Welcome to Life Journey. I'm your host, Theophilus McPherson. Today I'm discussing about sex in the 21st century. See, yes, sex in the 21st century is a joke. It's a literary joke because a person that just want to have sex, don't want to have marriage, is a person that want to die rather than to live. Now in our nation, sex it become like going to the grocery store and looking at the tag at the grocery store and buying, glory to God, the product that's on sale. Sex is not being, glory to God, being worth value. Sex is like work, is like worth in going to the thrift store and picking up a piece of trash that worth nothing. Sex in the 21st century is a person having your telephone number and the next day you having sex with that person. Sex is like going on the internet, talking on Facebook and talking to that person that lives down the street and then you want to have sex with them. My friend, look at it. Sex in the 21st century is women that wear leggings and, and wearing wigs and wearing all these things just to draw attention to get sex. Sex in the 21st century is women that wearing tattoo on her breast so you can look at her breast and be enticed. Sex in the 21st century is women wearing oh, makeup and, and wearing leggings and wearing tight black pants just to draw your attention to say, come have sex with me. Sex in the 21st century are private whores. You just get them for uh, less than an hour and then you don't even know their name where they live, but you just have sex with them. Sex in the 21st century is going to the grocery store, buying a piece of meat, you put her on the board and you chop her up and then you say, mm, that's not worth nothing. Sex in the 21st century is that marriage no more. If you get married, it's just for a minute or a week or a month, less than a year. Sex in the 21st century, my friend, is like women Glory to God, men don't love themselves. Women don't love themselves. But if you love yourself, a condom is not worth than a commitment. See, the difference between a condom and a commitment is commitment being that I will marry you and live ha happily ever after. But a condom is just a one-night stand. Glory to God.